Okay, so I got the uh, bigger claw wired to it now, here, and we need to restring it. So I might a actually uh, put this little clip as a separate video too, as well as part of this, part of this, because I know people are interested or may need to know. So this is the part here. Let's see if I can. Let me get a little bit. Okay, there you can see it. Right here is where your all your string is. And you, you always want extra, but you can pull this down a little bit, give yourself some to work with. I want to go up and around here. And then I had kind of talked about this before, but it was the machine that was broken and we had it wrapped around there and it's not supposed to be there. So thanks Ralph for pointing that out because that could cause other issues somewhere. Basically I was looking at one to restring the others and they were both like that, so I just kept restringing it like that. Okay. Sorry. Try to get it around here. And then back through. Okay. So we come here, it'll do that. Now we want it to go. So unfortunately, I'm a little afraid right here. See if we can get this a little better in frame. Okay. Actually, I'm going to burn the end of this a little bit. I'm trying to get as much fray. I'm going to stick her through here. Okay, it comes out the bottom here. Okay, now is where we're going to take our claw. Let's see. Let me move you over here. I just need to take out these. It's on this one, or it's just two screws. Pop these guys out real fast. And so if you're, depending on which part of this video you're watching, if you're watching this video to learn how to restring it, this little cap comes off here. Okay. And so you really don't have to worry about that part while you're restringing it. You're just going to want to come back over to here. Okay. And we're going to take this guy. And hopefully he'll fit through there. That is kind of a problem, isn't it? Okay, so the problem with this with this one is it's got this smaller hole. So I'm gonna see if I can't punch that out. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. And let's get back to this. So all we're gonna do is put this through here. And now it fits. Come out the other side here. And tie a couple knots. One knot, and two knots, okay, now what I'm going to do is cut this burnt end off, and I'm going to let it fray a little bit. Okay, fray it out a little bit. Now I'm going to burn it. should keep it if I don't burn myself I should keep it from going back through okay now all we have to do is attach the claw back to it so obviously that little gap there is gonna go where the wiring is 
two tiny screws. If I can get them in the right spot here. Am I on the frame still? Okay. Blocking everything with my fat fingers, but I'm sure you guys know how to screw a screw in. Sorry, I'm all shaky today. Well, every day. Been shaky in my old age. That's why I prefer using the tripod. Sometimes we just can't use it. Okay. Screw. And I've already put this uh, cage on the back on it too. So we just need to put the, uh, the, the other two pieces back together on it. And they are actually in the claw machine. I took them off just to see what was going on ahead of time. Hang on, I'm gonna pause this while I put the screw in. This is ridiculous. All right, so got it back together now. So this claw is going to go, the bigger claw is going to go into the Route 66 crane that we, uh, we put together. So now I'm gonna carry this over there and get it installed in the game. And then we'll take a couple plays and make sure everything works right. Be right back. 